So coming to the risk we course, uh, from tomorrow we are going to start this course. So in this course, what we will learn, uh, first we will see the introduction of uh, risk we, like what is risk we and uh, what is the uh, background of risk we and why we are going to learn risk we that we are uh, uh, going to learn first. And after that, we'll uh, see the risk we architecture. So in the risk we architecture, we will be having register sets, instruction formats and addressing modes. And we will be uh, studying the detailed study of uh, RV32i instruction set and RV64 uh, I base ISA and uh, if possible we will also discuss RV69 also. So we will we are going to discuss this. So we, we are going to uh, see RV32i, 64i and if possible we will see RV69. Uh, and uh, next we are going to see the extensions, extensions in uh, both RV32i and RV64i. Uh, so extensions uh, are uh, like multiply and divide uh, atomic instructions we have single precision floating point double precision floating point like that uh, uh, there are some extensions so we are going to discuss uh, those extensions also and after that we are going to start the design of risk processor using the very long okay so the prerequisite of this course is uh, you should know uh, the language very long language so that we can uh, design the processor code and we can write the code using the very long so we will implement it and uh, next we are going to develop the test bench using the system verlog. So this is also I am planning. So we will write the test bench using the system verlog. So we will create a test bench plan for this uh, risk we and we will create a test bench using the system verlog. So this is the basic uh, structure of the course and uh, yeah. So this these are all we are going to learn in this pro uh, learn in this course. So these are all the outcomes which you will gain after completing this course. Okay. So if you are having any uh, doubts or queries, uh, you can ask.